From Juno, we take a flight onto the dog camp on the Denver Glacier. The ride goes over the Mendelhall Glacier, the largest ice field in North America. We climb over the Denver mountain range rising to 7,000 feet and land on the site of a busy dog training camp. Here, a group of 20-year-olds train dogs for the 1,000-mile Yukon race, the toughest sled dog race in the world. There's 11 of us that live up here and we're here May till September. We stay in these weather ports you can see all around. We have like two to four people in each one and warm sleeping bags, so it's pretty comfy. Just make sure you don't get in between the two sleds or in between the sled and the dogs because they get harnessed up and they're really ready to go. They tend to like lurch forward a little bit. They're pretty rambunctious before they go. I've never seen anyone as excited to go to work as these dogs. Now I understand why the dogs get so excited. This is absolutely cool. Yeah, it's nice up here, huh? So you, you race with these guys? I don't. Um, I'm just a college student and I, I just got a good summer job. So. A summer job? Who would call this a job? I would pay to do this. Hello up there. Hey. You guys enjoy your ride? Oh, it's awesome. Everybody loves being here. The dogs love it. The trainers love it. And the mountains must love it too, because this is sustainable tourism at its absolute best, with minimal impact on the environment. Obviously, we can't we can't get everything off of the glacier, but but we too do try to make it a minimum. Every morning, and evening, and sometimes in the afternoon, we collect the dog crap and put it in buckets, carry it over to these 55-gallon drums, and they're underneath a helicopter sling net and they just sling the barrels away and we get all of the dog crap off of the glacier. Smaller and bolder, Dewey and um, Scrabble, Monopoly, um, Ash, Panther, Jasper, Dewey and Joey. So, you really hate this job, eh, right, guys? It's awful. Oh. Huh? <laughs> this guy makes it pretty bad. But other you really dog, help us, help I... us! As for the dogs, Little do they know how tough the Yukon race really is. Most of them won't even qualify for it. But for now, all of this feels absolutely perfect.